Well, he trialled here at the Valley and went quite well. 20 to 1 about him. Harbour Master favourite for Joe Marrera and they're off in the sixth race of the night. He jumped away quite well, Harbour Master. Marrera's going to be pretty happy just to sit in behind the speed and look for a one-off position. Sichuan exec, one of the first to hit the ground with France Valor and Dr. Good Habits pushing forward. Lucky Forever holding a prominent spot on the rail and Vanilla Deeper Out's going forward. Sunny Ying's running about fifth or sixth at the moment. One off with Take to the Limit caught a little bit deep and then Beauty Lead from Harbour Master, who's back fourth last, one off the inside. A length to Noble Deluxe from Autumn Gold and Willie Invictus is last of all. 1,200 metres to run and Dr. Good Habit rolls to the lead now from Vanilla who quickly moves up into second. Sichuan exec getting the box seat third. Take to the limits posted three wide with France Valor in the middle. A length then to Lucky Forever from Sunny Ying who's midfield one off. A length away Beauty lead the inside of the favourite Harbour Master and then two back to Noble Deluxe from Autumn Gold and a length away to Willie Invictus last of all. Who'd be ten lengths from the speed and there's more speed injected as they climb the hill with Take to the Limit court wide pushing on and now pressing on and taking up the running from Dr. Good Habit and Vanilla. Two lengths further back at the 600 then to France Valor, who's moving into the race nicely from Sichuan exec, Sunny Ying. Marrera hasn't touched Harbour Master yet, but he's getting itchy fingers. Beauty lead, Lucky Forever drops out. Noble Deluxe, Willie Invictus coming wide from Autumn Gold. Around the turn, Vanilla tackle, take to the limit with Sunny Ying, and Sunny Ying momentarily swept to the lead, but Harbour Master in hot pursuit. 2.50 out, Sunny Ying in front. Harbour Master's cutting him down. Willie Invictus and Noble Deluxe run on strongly. It's Harbour Master going to the lead. Willie Invictus with a late run. But this is 1,400 winners for John Moore. And Harbour Master wins at three parts to Willie Invictus. Sunny Ying probably held on for third. Noble Deluxe ran a nice race. And then Vanilla from Sichuan Exec and Beauty Lead. Further back to Autumn Gold. France Valor weakened out with Dr. Good Habit. And take to the limit one of the last with Lucky Forever. So Harbour Master over Willie Invictus, Sunny Ying doing enough for third and Noble Deluxe fourth and then back to Beauty Lead. But a huge milestone here for John Moore, 1,400 winners in Hong Kong with Harbour Master. And he started favourite and in the end jumped odds on. William Victus, great turn of foot. He's got to within three parts. Sunny Ying was a lot further back initially than probably most expected. McDonald gave him a lovely run. He kicked at the 300, but Harbour Master and Willie Invictus just overhauled him in the final 150 metres to run 1-2, and he's finished in third. Noble Deluxe, an honest effort from the seven-year-old back in fourth. 2, 10, 1, 4, a half by one and a quarter, 148, 66. Wow. Well, well, I mean... Uh the pace was on wasn't it so I thought they'd be slowly run as it turned out all the principles came from well off the speed congratulations to John Moore fine achievement 1400 winners uh, for John and uh, John settles up a strong contingent on the weekend as well but uh, pretty popular quartet 3335 uh, will be the unofficial dividend double on the night uh, so far with Joe Marrera and Right, uh, a nice patient race there on Harbour Master. And Jeez, that seems like a very good quartet payout, considering the placings. First, second, third favourite. and mm. I think it might have been first, second, third, fourth favourite in order. Double check that later. Beauty lead missed the kick. Uh, going back, Willie Invictus. A lot of the horses that were backed in this race were all back in the run as well. But what a charge going forward. We had, uh, well, lucky forever. Joining him was Sichuan exec. Then France Fella looking to pop in, but Sunny Ying's taken that spot. Dr. Good Habit wider and Vanilla. So we've got five across the track at the head. Take to the limit goes in three deep. Harbour Master, midfield one off with the Noble Deluxe tracking him, Autumn Gold, and the runner up, Willie Invictus, at the tail of the field. So Dr. Good Habit then rolls forward. The first section was 13 5, then they ran 22 05 as they passed the football club. So they were, they were putting on the speed early here and take to the limit was left out on a limb three wide no cover uh, for Andrea Atzeni so he continues to roll on so the pace has been strong already and he continues to make a, a move forward on take to limit who was uh, left without cover 
Um, down the back, Sonny Ng travels well, doesn't want to commit and come out just yet. Behind him, Harbour Master, Noble Deluxe, Willie Invictus. Uh, back to the inside, Sichuan Exec uh, travels sort of on and off the bridle a little bit, but um, he uh, got stuck in an awkward spot. Sonny Ng now starting to just... Uh, Get a little bit of a rig long, but hasn't changed his position yet. And Harbour Master half carting for Marrera at the moment, leaving his options open. But uh, when Sunny Ying made his move, Marrera happy to get onto the back of Sunny Ying, let him cart him into the race. Uh, Sichuan Exec came out there on Beauty Lead, who had to check, and then coursing around the Noble Deluxe, Noble Deluxe and Willie Invictus Wide of, of all. Well, Sunny Ying looked a big chance of winning here. Might have been a, a John Moore Quinella, uh, uh, but Harbour Master has had this drop on uh, his stable mate, better turn of foot. He actually runs over the top of him. Sonny Ng just running on empty with a big weight and William Victor stretching out well late and with all that pace uh, really suited his charge here this evening. $19, the final payout for Harbour Master and weight is right. The QP's 31.50, 42 and 81.50.